Hi, my name is Jess and I'm an Indigenous Australian. Growing up on the east coast of Australia, I was never fully aware that I was living on the doorsteps of one of the world's most natural wonders, the Great Barrier Reef. The Great Barrier Reef is immense. It can be seen from outer space and covers more than 340,000 square kilometres. The Great Barrier Reef is bigger than United Kingdoms, Holland and Switzerland combined. The Great Barrier Reef is made up of 3,000 coral reefs. There are also over 1,000 islands. These are continental, coral caves and mangroves. The marine life is incredible. 600 species of soft and hard coral, 133 sharks and rays and 1,625 fish species. I've been lucky enough to explore the fringing reefs of the Palm Island Group, Magnetic Island and Fitzroy Island. While snorkeling on the reef, I've had really cool encounters with stingrays, sharks, giant clams, green turtles, and even a manta ray. There are 70 traditional owner groups along the Great Barrier Reef. They have a strong connection to sea and country and traditional ecological knowledge that dates back to over 60,000 years. As a First Nations woman, I have cultural connections to the Great Barrier Reef from Darnley Island in the Torres Straits and the Butchula tribe on Fraser Island. My introduction to the marine science world was through a program called Aboriginals and Torres Strait Islanders and Marine Science, or ATSIMS for short. ATSIMS was a program designed to engage young Indigenous students in traditional ecological knowledge and Western marine science. Later on, I also became a Reef Check Ambassador, which is a non-for-profit organisation that helps engage the community to learn and care for the Great Barrier Reef. Townsville is an amazing place to explore the Great Barrier Reef. This small coastal city is actually a marine science hub. Lots of amazing research and conservation happens right here. We are home to Ames, the Australian Institute of Marine Science, uh, Gabrumpa, which is the Great Barrier Reef Marine Park Authority, and James Cook University, a world leading university in marine science. A new and exciting addition to our region is the Museum of Underwater Arts, or MOA for short. There are four parts to MOA, with the first being Ocean Siren on the Strand. Ocean Siren tells the story of climate change and how it affects our reef through culture, art and science. Part two of the MOA project is the Coal Greenhouse, located northeast of Townsville at John Brewer Reef. Weighing over 160 tonnes, the underwater greenhouse was designed to raise awareness of coral conservation. This unique experience allows you to visit a museum underwater. The artist who has over 1 billion views of his works is Jason DeCares Taylor. The next phase of the MOA project, Jason will be working with local artists that will help tell stories of culture and coral conservation. If you care about the environment, there are many ways you can get involved. One way you can get involved is doing a beach cleanup with your local organisation, Tangaroa Blue. You can also inspire others in your community by becoming a Reef Check Ambassador. You can also get involved in local schools with organisations like ATSIMS, Reef Ecologic and STARS. Do your bit for the planet and climate change. Actions such as walking, carpooling, taking the bus or riding a bike, turning off your power when you're not using it, or even reduce, reuse and recycle. Even small actions can make a big difference. 